Hello, my name is Vitaly, and today I will tell you how to design flexible detectors for MRI of carbon-13. Imaging of carbon-13 isotope requires high sensitivity detectors. One way to increase sensitivity is to implement close proximity receiver arrays, which is conveniently achieved by ultra-flexible coils. In order to keep the high detection performance, a preamplification circuitry should be co-integrated with the coil. The circuitry must have compact size, lightweight, and be compatible with MR environment. To fulfill the requirements, we implement an ultra-low noise preamplifier with integrated high-power pulse protection, active and passive decoupling circuitry. The size of this preamplifier is quite small, as you can see in this picture, and it's only 16 by 19 millimeters. It is based on a three element matching and decoupling network, which matches the coil to the optimal noise impedance of the active device. And at the same time provides maximum available impedance at the input terminals of the coil, realizing so-called preamplifier decoupling. The design equations are coming from our earlier work and more details can be found in this paper. The equations can be used to design high impedance as well as low impedance preamplifiers, which is actually useful in designing preamplifiers for coaxial self-resonant coils. Out of four solutions provided by these equations, a T network is realized here, and it consists of uh, a 560 picofarad series capacitor, 10, uh, 110 picofarad parallel capacitor and 2.7 microhenry series inductor. Here you can also see the output L-shaped matching network, which basically transforms output impedance of the active device to 50 ohm. You can see protection diodes at the input and active decoupling network. The coil loop is made of a flexible one millimeter diameter conductor. The diameter of the loop is uh, eight centimeters which is chosen out of imaging considerations. To avoid interaction with hydrogen uh, coils in the scanner, a parallel LC resonator is integrated in the loop. It is tuned to block the hydrogen signal in the coil at uh, 127.8 megahertz. The effect of this blocking resonator is visible when you measure decoupling with a double loop probe. The total noise figure of the amplifier, including this matching and decoupling network, is uh, approximately 0.6 decibel. The resulting impedance of the preamplifier at the terminals of the coil is shown on the Smith chart. As you can see, the preamplifier is noise matched when directly connected to the coil and at the same time presents high impedance to the input terminals of the loop, realizing preamplifier decoupling. The coil is used as an element in eight channel array. The photograph of the array with cover removed uh, is shown here. The preamp circuit size is small fraction of the array, which supports the array flexibility. To minimize noise coupling between the uh, channels, the coils are critically overlapped. The critical overlapping is found empirically by measuring signal to noise ratio as a function of distance between the coils. As one can see from the measurements, the critical overlapping appears close to two centimeters, which is 25% of the coil uh, diameter, which is what typically expected from this type of loop coils. The test imaging, uh, to test the pre-imaging properties uh, of the array, it was applied to a human uh, head phantom. The photograph of the imaging setup in the scanner is shown here. The imaging experiment shows a reasonable coverage. It should be noted that the array length is uh, 50 centimeters, while the phantom head perimeter is uh, approximately 60 uh, centimeters, meaning that uh, the phantom could not uh, be covered entirely. This is the reason for a uh, uh, darker area on top of the image, where there is no active element actually present. As expected, the high sensitivity is achieved at the surface and lower sensitivity further in depth, which follows the sensitivity profile of a loop coil. The array is flexible, lightweight, and uh, easy to handle due to flexibility of the implemented wires, 
and a compact preamplifier design with integrated noise matching as well as passive and active decoupling circuits. The design is easily scalable and is potentially useful for realizing large arrays, preserving flexibility, sensitivity, and patient conformity. If you want to know more details, you are welcome to contact me by this email.